Move over big name vacation destinations because Myrtle Beach is on a mission. The Las Vegas, Hawaii, New York have been in the, the national spotlight for years and years and years, and I think it's Myrtle Beach's turn now. City spokesperson Mark Crua says Myrtle Beach is gaining attention all across the country. Whether it's Myrtle Manor or the Country Music Festival, you know, th those are national ranked events that we'll get some attention and publicity for. An executive vice president of the Myrtle Beach Area Chamber of Commerce, Scott Schultz, says he's noticed Myrtle Beach attracting a national audience in recent years. When you look at the top 50 cities that actually come to our website, visit MyrtleBeach.com, we never had one that was west of the Mississippi. Now we can count Los Angeles, Seattle, San Francisco, Denver, Phoenix, and even Dallas in our top 50. And that audience is likely to grow even bigger this summer. In exactly four months, some of the biggest names in country music will be right here for a three-day country music festival. Then, one month later, the sights and sounds of the Grand Strand will make it to the big screen when Magic Mike Double XL hits theaters nationwide. You know, the thing about having celebrities in market is that uh, they have an active fan base across social media, so we'll be able to engage with that and even amplify our message even further. It most definitely gives us a, a national awareness that, you know, sometimes our advertising alone couldn't generate. That awareness is something businesses on the boardwalk are happy to see. The boardwalk has died down a little bit and anything just to elevate the boardwalk helps. Since the pavilion's gone, it's only going to help us. From reality TV to major summer events, city officials hope to boost local business and continue to sell Myrtle Beach to vacationers from states away. Reporting in Myrtle Beach, Alex Heaton, WPDE News Channel 15.